Hey Gemini, welcome to your, oh, here we go. Welcome to your December reading here, guys, okay? We have the Two of Cups and the High Priestess jump out straight away. If you're new, welcome. Please subscribe and remember to hit the notification bell. If you are looking for information about the cards I use, please check out the description box. In the description box, you'll also find information on how to contact me for a personal reading. Okay, Gemini, you're feeling the pull of a soulmate here. Could be a Pisces or a Cancer with the High Priestess there, but um, I feel like it's just your intuition just feels the pull of them, new or old. You just know something's coming here, and I feel like you're just about to meet somebody. It could be here in December. And just remember when I'm saying you're just about to meet a new soulmate, it could be you're just about to give birth and meet your child or your wife's about to give birth and meet your child. A child would be your soulmate too. It's your soul family. So yeah, it's like you're about to meet a very important connection to you. Nine of Wands. Okay, so look how far you've come on this journey throughout this year. The ups and downs. This is a rest, needing a rest period here. You may be on your own, um, having faced a lot of challenges throughout 2019, but you feel the changes coming with this high priestess. Trust, okay? This feels like a, it might be a test as well, okay? So if you're feeling like, well, I went through all this on my own, and you start to distrust your own intuition here, you know, just trust it. This is a resting period. Doesn't mean that nobody's ever coming. <clears throat> it's just a period of rest. The devil card, yeah. It's like these toxic thoughts are trying to get into your mind here. Um, trying to mess with your intuition. Trust. Before God sends a blessing, the devil just tries to, you know, take a bite out of you here. Look. Tries to trick you, play with you here. So you start to doubt yourself. If that's the case, don't doubt, okay? Stay strong. Stay strong here. Could be a Capricorn for some. The star. That What did I say? Your wish is about to be granted. You can feel it here. Don't let doubt creep in because you haven't seen anything. You've been in this nine of wands protected fence here, okay? So you've been protected by the divine at this time. When God's just about to bless you... The devil tries to step in to make create doubt within you to try and drink bring your energy down. So here it is, the star. Here's your fair warning. Could be an Aquarius you're dealing with, but God's just about to bless you with a soulmate here. Don't doubt it, okay? I know you've been on this journey. It's been hard. There's been ups, there's downs, you know, rounds and all sorts of things. Page of Wands. Something is about to begin. Something new, something fresh, something exciting. Communication, something you're not expecting here. Something you even wished for. Could be a younger fire sign as well. Like I said, maybe a baby, if you wished for a baby. Um, because pages can be children as well. But here it's like something exciting is about to happen to you. Just hold faith here, hold tight. Trust your instincts. If your instincts were telling you, I can feel them nearby, but I can't really see them in my world right now. It's because right now you're in this fence of protection. But here, um, the devil may just try sneak in to sow seeds of doubt when God's just about to bless you here. The magician, I told you something new is coming. Something's manifesting. Something's about to begin. Okay, so you could have been trying to manifest this the whole time. Um, you know, praying and fasting, intermittent fasting here will do a lot of good for you. It will help you stay on the course here. Stay on track. Don't be sidetracked here. Okay. Devil is a liar. Two of swords here. Okay. Indecision holding you back. Well, you know, is this really going to happen? Devil. Do I trust? You know, I haven't seen anything. Devil. Indecision will do nothing but hold you back. It's like worry. 
it serves no purpose okay because that indecision is itself a decision to not trust to not take action when your gut tells you here take action okay so with these twos you could be signing a new contract okay wheel of fortune things are about to turn around here in december things are about to change Something or somebody new here is about to manifest right in your life. It's in the heart of your reading there, okay? The star, the um, page, the magician. It's about to manifest. Just trust it here. Things will turn around for the better. The Hierophant, there you go. Could even be a marriage proposal, signing, um, you know, a contract of marriage with the Hierophant. Could be a Taurus for some. But here I feel like it's God saying... You know, have patience. Don't try and force it to happen. Just have patience because I'm telling you, I'm going to bless you here. Okay? Trust. Trust you will be blessed in this situation. A blessing's about to come. You don't even know it yet. It's like you're blindfolded with your eyes here. And it's like, like I said up here, it's like you're being tested. Do you trust? Do you have faith? She's blocking this. Um, this is the high priestess blocking um, the gate here, it looks like. So she's like, you know, come forward. Be tested. Our tests will be our testimony. Strangely lonely. Holding on way too tight. When we hold on to things way too tight, we do it out of fear. A card 17, 1 plus 7 is 8. Again, indication of something um, looping back with the infinity sign there. Autumn is my last chance. See? Please don't lose hope. This is exactly how I was seeing you. Like, worried, scared that, okay, I've trusted all this time, nothing's shown up, I'm still alone. That's the devil energy. God's just about to bless you here. Take that blessing. Autumn wasn't your last chance, okay? <clears throat> and we have creating heaven on earth. It's happening, okay? It's happening. That just fell out of the deck there. Some of you need to know that it's happening. Starseed, what lights you up? You know, look to the positive, look at things, focus on what makes you happy, what make, raises your vibrations. I personally use music if I start to feel down. Focus on what lights you up here. Seeds just about to be planted. Good luck, guys.